Hello and welcome back to Malaysia. Today we are going to go for an explore around an area called TTDI. That's the abbreviated name anyway. I'll put the full name on the screen. Let's get out and explore. What you will notice as we are walking around is it's quite an affluent area of Kuala Lumpur. If you are into hipster cafes, then this is the area to head to. Also quite a lot of businesses around here as well. If you are coming to work in Kuala Lumpur or are an expat, then this is an area to check out. It is only four stops to KL Central on the MRT. And this is one of the many apartment complexes here in TTDI called The Greens. Alright, I think the market is up here somewhere, so we'll keep walking, having a wander around. I'm either too early or too late, you never know with markets. So yeah, it seems to be a mix of all sorts of items, fruit, vegetable, chickens I can see over here. Yeah, pretty quiet. Also got the Christmas tree up. I think I needed to be here earlier. A lot of these stores are closed. The people are very friendly. I'm literally the only foreigner walking around here getting a few funny looks as I'm filming, but yeah, people are nice here, welcoming. So this here is like a seeds and, ah, what is this? Chili, dry chili. Chili, ah, dry chili. Looks very good, smells good. Oh wow. Ah, up there. So yeah, come to Lizar Chili, Rempat and Spices here in TTDI. Lovely lady. Also lots of fruit and veg here as well. See passion fruit, guava. Smells are incredible. That lovely lady gave me some spices. So this is fried fish. I'm not too sure what's in here. But yeah, Lazar chili curry spices. Thank you so much. <laughs> so yeah, it's a really interesting market. Within five minutes of the market is a park area called Taman Rimba Kiara. I don't know if I pronounced it right. It's very quiet, that's for sure. So this is the entrance here. The first observation is that the sign is all in Malay, so obviously not many tourists come here, or foreigners. So peaceful. Just over there they've got football goalposts. See so how you can play football here popular spot here in Malaysia and as you can see this Englishman is sweating like crazy and it's not as hot as it normally is in Malaysia with the monsoon season it's definitely a little bit cooler and this must be a little area for the park workers you can see some clothes hung up on the window don't know if you can see it but there's a squirrel just running up this tree and it's a grey one, I think. I see very few grey squirrels. Don't know if you can see, he's just hung up with his feet. Got picnic tables over here. I suspect at the weekend this place will be pretty busy. Yeah, I was just chatting to a nature photographer. And she said it's a great place to come. Lots of birds, sometimes rare birds you see here. And wildlife. Bit of an overcast day today. But still nice for a walk the weather's not too bad it's not too warm lots of little trails like this which is good it feels like you're walking around with me right now I guess I've not done one of these walking exploring videos for a while I thought today why not so yeah so quiet lots of greenery of fresh air I've seen quite a few nature photographers today. It's very rare that you see that. So I understand there's a really good hiking route around here. And I'm not gonna do it today. Hoping I might be able to get it before 
I leave, if not next time I come. I know not everyone enjoys these exploring videos where I'm giving commentary, but I know most people prefer me to be eating nasi lemak or doing something like that, but I just like getting away from the hustle and bustle and coming somewhere here, like here is really good to clear the mind. And I'm here for one more week, so my plan is for the next seven days, every day, I'm going to get out and explore and capture it on video. And then, over the next three or four weeks, we'll have videos on the channel whilst I'm back in the UK. Right, so yes, I think we're going to head back into the main area of TTDI and continue doing some exploring. So this road separates TTDI, if you walk across it you can get to the area that we've just been to with the shopping mall and the Starbucks and McDonald's. If you're looking for somewhere to work and get good coffee, definitely recommend Common Man Coffee Roasters. So today's video was more of an explore around an area that most foreigners and tourists won't be familiar with. So TTDI, it's worth coming if you're wanting to stay here for a longer period of time. If you like the coffee scene, then there are tons of coffee shops, all independent places around this area. Lots of shops, lots of little parks and things to do, a few hiking trails as well. So it's a really interesting area to live in. 